Welcome back everyone. Hope everyone's ha having a great Thursday out there today. I'm recovering from a very bad sinus infection as you can tell by my voice. It's going to be a little raspy today, but we'll get through this. Today is another special request video. A uh, good friend of the channel, Danny and Gray's. Go check out their uh, channel, Danny and Gray's Cards and Toys. They've always got some great videos going on over there. Uh, as you know, Danny and I are in the middle of a little transaction. He's wanting to add some cards to his Jeff Gordon collection. So I obliged and said that I'd make some videos of the Jeff Gordon cards that I have in mind. And he's going to message me which cards that uh, he wishes to add to his collection. So without further ado, let's just get started. And i got a stack off here to the left, and we'll just get rolling here. Have a 95 upper deck virtual velocity. This might be 96. I'm probably right in, I'm saying 96, there you go, 96 Upper Deck Virtual Velocity. Nice die cut card there. Then we go to an 06 VIP Lap Leader card of Jeff Gordon. Of course, all these are going to be Jeff Gordon, so I'm not going to say his name every time. But an 06 Lap Leader. Then we have an 03 Premium die cut just it's just a base set card but it's die cut it's the champion card they had champion and then they had challengers i believe that were cut in the opposite direction now we have an 06 vip headgear of course we all know i'm, I'm working on a master set of 96 vip and the 90 i believe the 06 as well as the 96 set did have die cuts in both of those all these cards are the same but it's finish line. I'm just going to drop the rest of them down over here. But it's finish line. And I want to say that's, this might be a proto... Yeah, it's a prototype card. So yeah, this is a, a promo or a prototype of the 90... Is that 93 finish line? Yes, 1993 finish line. So this was before he became a full-time Cup Series driver. And we have Wheels American Thunder from 2005. Had to get that American Eagle. Nice looking card. There's the back of it. We'll just keep rolling. Uh, 1995 also. Uh, Pinnacle, through their various sets, be it Action Pack, Pinnacle, Pole Position, etc. Maybe it wasn't Pole Position. Uh, Zenith, perhaps. Um, Pinnacle was like Press Pass, and they had many different sets out at the time. They had a Chevy Madness set that had all the Chevy drivers, included Earnhardt, Skinner, um, DW, Jeff Green, Steve Grissom, Dave Marcus, Ken Schrader. You get the gist, but there, there it is. It's number 15 out of 15 in the set. And it's from 19... And we're not going to focus in very well on that. 1997. I said 95, but I was thinking of another set. Uh, Press Pass 2006 Velocity. Of course, a lot of these cards in this era were embossed with whatever logos, wordings, phrases, etc. And you have kind of like an acetate card here, 06 Wheels American Thunder American Muscle. We've seen this one earlier, the champion card. Some of these I've got sleeves, some of these I do not. So that's kind of a project of mine. I'm going through, got a lot of projects with my cards going on right now. I believe that's 04 lap leaders. Yeah, 2004 VIP lap leaders. Some of those are a little difficult to read. I believe this is an 04 as well. And this is a making making the show insert die cut as well. Then we have 07 premium base set card there, number 21. Another 07 premium base set, number 49. 03 premium. Base set number 37. Another contender. There's a parallel version of this where the, the that's a red foil instead of gold foil. But I, I'm sure I've got one. It probably is just later on in the box. We have an 09, or is that 10? 10, 10 Press Path Stealth. 
maximum velocity of Jeff Gordon. Of course, you can see the wing on the back of the car, so that was during the near the end of the COT era with the wings before they went back to the spoilers. It's a base set card number 54. You have an insert from 2007 Press Pass. This is a snapshot set. Always liked all the snapshot insert sets that Press Pass had. They got really innovative. Some of them look like little Polaroid pictures. Some of them look like little digital cameras. So Press Pass was very innovative and creative with the way that they did their snapshots insert set. Here's an upper deck card. I want to say this is from 99. Yep, 1999, base set, card number 24. We have a 98 Max. Of course, we discussed in a previous video anything from 1997 moving forward was an upper deck product. And there you see the upper deck logo there on the lower right corner of the card. This is also is a base set card. Max filed for bankruptcy in 1996. Upper deck bought the assets and continued the label from 97 to 2000. Then we have Predator, 1997. That was the only year Predator cards were made, I believe. I know Viper had a set in a couple years, and this was a Wheels brand. Of course, Wheels, I believe, later got bought by Press Pass. We have an 02 or 04? 04, 04, okay. 04 VIP base set card, number 56. Another 04 VIP base set. And, of course, the way that I've got them sorted out, there's truthfully no rhyme or reason. I used to do them by sets. I used to do them by drivers. used to do my... I just, I'd go back and forth with the way I want to do it. I'm trying to get all my cards separated by driver. Another 04 base set. This time the car card of Jeff, number 38. We've got a couple base set cards. So, from 04 VIP, this one's number 5. Right now I'm trying to get them separated by driver. It seems to just be easier and better to work out for me that way. Now we're going to get into some inserts because I have a huge stack of cards in top load. So we have 07 wheels, full throttle. Don't mind the prices on these. I bought some of these in a lot. And the person that I bought them from just had different random things stickered up. And so that's not what I paid for them, nor is what I am, nor is it what I would charge for them either. So we have an 03 high gear top tier. This is one of my favorite sets. I love the way that they have the numbers on the, the little podium there, or the little pylon. Number four out of six. Some of these, I need to take this out of the team bag. I'm not real big in team bags. I'll use them, but I'm just not real big on them. So we have an 02 high gear wheels Sunday sensation number four. So like I say again, these are not, prices are not indicative of what I paid for them nor what I would charge anyone for these. They just happen to be what was on them when I bought them. So we have another top tier. This one's from 2004. Actually it's top ten. Again, I like the scoring pylon. I like the way that they have the driver's names like they are on the, almost like the uh, scoring pylon at IMS here in Indianapolis. We have top tier number TT4 again. And there's another one. So I had a couple of those. Looks like we got some base set cards that were... Again, I... What year is that? 06 wheels high gear. I don't know who would be charging $8 or even $15 for a base set card, but that's kind of silly. Again, I bought a lot of these in a lot, so... O, O2 wheels high gear base set card that might that's actually the it says FG1 is the number there try to get it focused in a little bit FG1 so I believe that is the parallel version of that card and then we have 06 or 04 04 wheels American Thunder base set card number 42 so there's another one. Then we have another 05 Wheels American Thunder. Always like some of the American Thunder sets, 04, 05, 06. They had some really neat designs to those. So this card is 63. Again, I don't know who's charging $3, but obviously they didn't get that. Then we have an 04 Wheels American Thunder Race Rituals. Number 65, base set card. 
Looks like we're going through an American Thunder uh, bunch of them. I think that's 06. Stars and Stripes, number 70. We just keep rolling here. There's another one, number 65. Made in America from Wheels American Thunder, 06. And let's not drop that one. Number 73, so that's obviously a base set card. Stars and Stripes, we've already had a couple of them. Then we had this guy, the Dream Team, from 06 American Thunder. Base set card number 37. Okay, we still... So we had that one already. That's the base set from 04 number 42. And we have another car card, Hot Rod, from 06 number 43. We have a base set from 06, number, that's well, the checklist. Then we have base set 05, number 8. Got a few inserts coming up here, so we have American Muscle from 04. Again, kind of that clear acetate card. Number... I guess it's number, I can't even read that, 4 of 9 out of the set, AM4. There's another one, AM4. American Racing Idol from 06. So RI6 is the card number on that one. Keep moving forward here. This is 05 Thunder. American Eagle AE7. AE7. About two thirds of the way through this stack, so we'll probably wrap it up after we get through the rest of the cards in this stack here on the left. 04 American Thunder, American Eagle. We have an 02 Stealth Base Set. Number 28, another stealth base set from 03, number 62, 01 stealth, I never did have a lot of these cards, but again, I got these in a lot, it's number, can't even read the number, 58, another 01 stealth, Jeff and Brooke, Number 61, 01 Stealth, number 56, we have an 04 Stealth base set, I was in the buying cards at this time, number 25, there's another one, then we have a Speed Freaks from 02 Stealth, and that is the parallel version. As you can see, it's got the foil down here on the lettering is red. I think it was silver foil was the base set. But P64, so that is a parallel version. We have another 01 Stealth. Number 60. G60. So it's a, it's a gold parallel version there. You see it down here, the foil and the lettering is a little gold versus silver. 07 Press Pass, number 9, Base Set Cards. There's his stats from the previous year, in case you guys are interested. Want to pause that and read some of those. 2003 Base Set, Press Pass, number 60. Another Base Set, I think we may have just had this one, I'm not quite sure, number 10. Again, here's the snapshots that I was talking about earlier where they made them look like smaller portraits. This one's from 03. You see the back of it looks like a Polaroid uh, instant picture that you had back in the 70s and 80s. So that's, this is the same one, number 7 to 36. Then we have a parallel version of the 03 Press Pass. So you see it's kind of got a hollow foil type lettering, number P10. 
So we have another snapshot. Then we have a 2007 Press Pass base set card. Actually, this is a Walmart exclusive. It's either a Walmart or a Target exclusive. Some of the packs would have certain drivers. This is JGA. Both of these are JGA. You had Walmart, Target, and I think there might have been even Kmart exclusive packs. And they had different drivers that were lettered up differently. Okay. Excuse me. <clears throat> Press Pass Stealth 05, no boundaries. I didn't care much for this set. I just didn't like the design. Other people probably really enjoyed that set. I have the number covered up, so I'm not going to go with that. But, Danny, you'll know if you need that one or not. This looks like the final card in this one. I'm going to go ahead and take it out of this team bag. Looks like somebody had it in a screw-down holder as well. So, what year is that? 2003 Press Pass Velocity. Looks like they wanted $15 for it, so Velocity number 2. So that's a pretty good size stack that we went through. Let me grab just a few more here that we can go through and give this video a few more minutes. We're just at the 16 minute mark. So we have an 01 VIP, number 12. Another a couple more 01 VIPs here. That's number 34, the All-Star Race. Another one. We have another Jeff Gordon base set from 03, I think. Yeah, 03 VIP, number 5. This looks like 04 VIP right here. Number 56, base set card. There's another one. Another 04 VIP base set card. I like this set somewhat. I believe they did have some legends in the back half of the set. Rusty Wallace, Dale Earnhardt, some other big names back in the... Uh, I don't want to say... I guess more of a contemporary part of it, because you had pioneers that would have made up the 50s and the 60s and the 70s and 80s and 90s was the growing eras. Okay, you have another 04 VIP... Gordon Base, number 56. I think we just had that one. So I apologize. Oh, is this 03 or 02? 02 VIP. Numbers extremely difficult because thanks to Press Pass, they put a black lettering and a dark blue background. Sunday Glory VIP 03, it looks like. Number 27, so that is a base set card. Number 27. We'll do. Looks like we pretty much have a bunch of duplicates here, so I'll go ahead and just flip through these right quick, and we'll get to the end of the video. Looks like we have an 03 VIP All-Star card, number 36, and the last card we'll do for the day is an 03, looks like it's an 03 Making the Show. Flip that over. Looks like it's MS-14, but I can't read it. I'll pull it off camera. MS-14 out of 24. So that'll conclude our special request video for today. I'm going to have several more of these. I've still got quite a few cards to go through. So Danny, get back with me on that. I know uh, you're looking forward to seeing this video. Hope everyone else enjoys it. If you have any questions about these cards, they, you know, I'm interested to sell or trade or whatever anybody's interested in doing. Of course, we're working our way. We're almost to 60 subs. Once we get to 100, we're going to have a giveaway. Again, you all, got, you all guys know what cards are up for up for grabs here. you got a Tony Stewart, a Ken Griffey Jr., and a Braun Strowman rookie. So those will be the three cards that will be up for grabs. And once we get to 100 subs, we'll get that contest all laid out and ready to go for you guys. So hope everybody's having a good Thursday. Hopefully we'll come back tomorrow and do some more of these cards. I do have a box of 91 tracks that I'm getting ready to open up. So, I'm getting excited about doing that one too. The hunt for more Jeff Gordon rookies. Of course, you see one right back here in the corner, kind of hiding behind the stack. But, I've already got a few of those. Always like to add to the collection. So, I hope everyone has a great, great rest of your evening. Thanks for watching. Hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you all next time.